and here are some important points that you all must keep in mind the first point is so you can start following the same schedule that you would be following on the exam day so first point is to acclimatize now the second point is to consolidate my dear students we are now within 15 days of j main examination of 2026 and here are some important points that you all must keep in mind the first point is that you should start to acclimatize yourself based on the exam day what does that mean on the exam day you would be waking up at a certain time it may be 5 30 am it may be 6 30 am depending upon your expected distance uh, from the examination center you would be having your breakfast at a specific time so you can start following the same schedule that you would be following on the exam day go to sleep on the previous night at the same time as how you would be doing on the exam day wake up at the same time eat your meals on the same time keep yourself on the table on your uh, you know study desk from 9 a.m to 12 p.m window and 3 p.m to 6 p.m window and keep solving problems during that time so that your mind and body is habituated around solving problems during that time so that is a very important point so first point is to acclimatize now the second point is to consolidate for the past two years maybe more than that you have been trying to learn a lot of new concepts chapters application of concepts for majority of them you would have succeeded there would be some concepts or chapters which would have troubled you and in which you do not feel that confident in the final days it is important that you consolidate your strength revise theory in your strength areas see the examples that you have attempted before see the questions that you could not do earlier from these areas and tell yourself that these are the areas which i'm going to target like if any question comes from this we are definitely going to do first as compared to the other topics in which you don't feel that confident so the second step is to consolidate the third step is to ensure that during these 10-15 uh, days you are writing full syllabus test okay it is very important to practice on the entire syllabus and not fall for the trap of part syllabus uh, testing or part syllabus study you should focus on revising the entire syllabus over and over and over again <coughs> that was the third point now i'll talk about some non-academic aspect also so the fourth point would be to have the right expectations from yourself so students when you write full syllabus test during these days whatever you are scoring assuming that you are writing the right level of test you are writing the a right test series for example a J test series is one so if you are writing test from a test series which maintains the level at the level of J main whatever marks you are getting in these tests on an average okay expect to score somewhere around that only your marks in the final exam will not fluctuate by more than 20 okay whatever your, is your average score it will not fluctuate by more than 20 in in the final exam so don't pressurize yourself by creating um unwarranted expectations from yourself see if your average score is hovering around 220 in the full syllabus test don't expect to score a 280 on the examination day you can pray for that you can hope that it happens but if it doesn't happen then don't get disappointed or um you know don't pressurize yourself in saying that i have to chase 280 uh whatever you are getting in these days is a cumulative is outcome of a cumulative effort opportunity the institute the teacher that you got all of this combined is re responsible for the marks that you are getting and therefore it won't change significantly in the last 10 15 days so prepare yourself uh, by setting the right expectation from yourself first fifth point cut out the noise okay this is the period when the student become anxious okay so don't give in to that anxiety your friends may be doing a lot of things the person you consider your competition may be doing a lot of things uh, or the person may be telling you that he or she is doing a lot of things he may not be doing he or she may not be doing um but cut out that noise guys that um what uh, someone else is doing i need to do that no um what about my practicals what about my boards what about j advance i'm not preparing for that 
uh, how about I write uh, J main second attempt? I'll probably do better. Get these thoughts out of your mind. Don't think about advance right now. Don't think about J mains two the second attempt. Don't think about boards. They happen later. Regarding practicals, yes, the practicals will happen uh, within the next 10 days or so. Um, set one day for your practicals and just worry about practicals. Just work on your practicals on that day. Okay, before that, don't dwell on it. Okay, um, so that, that is, you know, cut out the noise and focus on what needs to be done. Okay, the next point, the sixth point is to take care of your health. Very important, guys. If you fall sick during the next 10, 15 days, the amount of time that you will lose, okay, may not be significant, mind you. I'm not saying that it would be a very significant time. Uh, but the importance of that time is too high. And most importantly, it will affect you psychologically. The thought that I was forced to waste time and my competitors were able to devote this time to their studies will actually uh, demotivate you a lot. It will uh, lower your confidence. So as far as possible, try to take care of your health and not fall sick. Okay, so that is the sixth point that I want you to focus upon. And finally, guys, uh, the seventh point, which I think is uh, very important, which likes, uh, acts like a catalyst to ensure that the first six are happening. The seventh point is a self-belief. Okay, believe in yourself. Tell yourself that you have worked hard and that you are going to get rewarded accordingly. You will not be denied what you deserve. Tell yourself, believe in God, pray and get blessings from your elders as much as possible. So these are the things that you need to take care of in the last 15 days and everything will fall into place. You will get the desired results.